my dear students welcome back to our channel in this video i will be explaining the telangana ict 2024 shift 1 exam section c communication ability questions let's get started with a quick revision and some easy tricks to solve these questions fast stay tuned question 151 Someone who criticizes cherished ideas or beliefs is a an underscore 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 underscore. Let's understand each option. 1. Numismatic, related to coins or currency. 2. Iconoclast, a person who challenges or criticizes traditional beliefs or ideas. 3. Doctor, medical professional. 4. Scientist, studies science, not necessarily criticize beliefs. So, the correct answer is 2. Iconoclast. Easy trick to remember. Think. Icon is equal to symbol or belief. Clast is equal to breaker. Iconoclast is equal to belief breaker. Imagine someone breaking idols, icons, that's someone who challenges old beliefs. Time saving tip. If the question says criticize beliefs, Look for a word with icon or clast. Final answer to iconoclast. Next question 152. The government policy is to make India self-reliant. It encourages underscore 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 industry. First, understand the sentence. Self-reliant means not depending on others, especially other countries. So, the industry should be local or Indian. Let's check options. 1. Foreign from another country, opposite of self-reliant. 2. Indigenous, native, local, Indian made. 3. Non-local, not from the local area. 4. Unavailable, not present. So, the correct answer is 2. Indigenous. Easy trick to remember. Indigenous is equal to in plus the plus genius of India Indian born local. Think made in India is equal to indigenous. One minute shortcut. If the sentence talks about self-reliance or Atmanirbhar Bharat, choose local or indigenous. Final answer to indigenous. Next question 153. When Rajesh was asked to introspect himself by his teacher, he meant to carefully understand the word introspect. It means to look inside yourself or examine your own thoughts and feelings. Now check the options. 1. Examine his own thoughts. This is the correct meaning. 2. Look up to means admire someone. 3. Look forward means to be excited about something in future. 4. Look out means to be careful or watchful. So, the correct answer is, 1. Examine his own thoughts. Easy trick to remember. Intro is equal to inside, spect is equal to look. Introspect is equal to look inside yourself. Think. Mirror of the mind is equal to introspection. One minute tip. If the word is introspect, always think about self-thinking or inner thoughts. Final answer, 1. Examine his own thoughts. A must-know word for SSC, UPSC, banking exams. Next question, 154. My friend wavered between two opinions. Focus on the word wavered, it means to be unsure or confused between choices or to hesitate. Now check each option. 1. Decided means made a firm choice. Opposite of wavered. 2. Hesitated means unsure, not able to decide quickly. Perfect match. 3. Thought just means thinking, not necessarily confused. 4. Arrived at means reached a decision. So, the correct answer is 2. Hesitated. Easy trick to remember. Waver is equal to waves is equal to moving back and forth. Like a wave, when someone wavers, they go back and forth between options hesitate. One minute tip. 
If someone is uncertain or stuck between choices, think of waver is equal to hesitate. Final answer to hesitated. Common word in competitive English, remember the wave trick. Next question 155. He was kind. He was underscore 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 even towards his opponents. Step by step. 1. Look at the sentence meaning. He is kind and the second sentence supports this, saying he is kind even to opponents. 2. Let's check the options. 1. Magnificent means grand or beautiful, not about kindness. 2. Magnanimous means kind and generous, especially to enemies. 3. Foolish means not wise. 4. Unkind, opposite of kind. So, the correct answer is 2. Magnanimous. Easy trick to remember. Magna is equal to big, so magnanimous is equal to big-hearted, generous and kind. Think, Mahatma Gandhi was magnanimous, kind even to his enemies. One minute tip. If someone is kind to opponents, it means they are magnanimous. Final answer to magnanimous. Important for SSC, banking, defense and other English exams. Next question 156. What is the antonym opposite of noble? First, understand. Noble means good, honorable, respectable. Now, look for the word that means the opposite, bad, dishonorable. 1. Innoble, not a real or standard English word. 2. Unnoble, not commonly used, incorrect. 3. Ignoble, means dishonorable, shameful, opposite of noble. 4. Disnoble, not a valid word in English. So, the correct answer is 3. Ignoble. Easy trick to remember. Ig in English often means opposite or negative, like ignore is equal to not notice. So, ignoble is equal to not noble is equal to dishonorable. One minute tip. When finding opposites, ignore words that look wrong or sound odd. Use known prefixes like ig, in, dis, wisely. Final answer, 3, ignoble. Useful for SSC, banking and all English related exams. Next question 157. The antonym opposite of amateur is. First, understand the word. Amateur means a beginner or someone who does something without professional skill or for fun. Now, let's look at the options. 1. Layman, a non-expert, same as amateur. 2. Professional, someone trained, skilled and does it as a job. Opposite of amateur. 3. Non-professional, same meaning as amateur. 4. Incompetent means lacking skill, but doesn't directly oppose amateur. So, the correct answer is 2. Professional. Easy trick to remember. Amateur versus professional is like. Gully cricket player, amateur versus Virat Kohli, professional. One minute tip. If the word is about skill level, amateur is equal to beginner, so antonym is equal to professional. Final answer to professional. Very common in SSC, banking and defense exams. Next question 158. The synonym same meaning of compassion is. First, understand. Compassion means deep kindness, care, and sympathy for someone who is suffering. Now, check the options. 1. Compress means to press something tightly. Not related. 2. Kindred means family or related by blood. 3. Kindness means being kind, caring, and helpful. Same meaning as compassion. 4. Compromise means to settle a disagreement by giving up something. So, the correct answer is 3. Kindness. Easy trick to remember. Compassion is equal to passion for helping others. 
If someone has compassion, they show kindness. One minute tip. When you see compassion, think of sympathy and kindness. Choose the word that shows care. Final answer, 3. Kindness. Very common in SSC, Banking and English Comprehension exams. Next question 159. Synonym, same meaning of prompt is. First, understand. Prompt means to do something quickly or without delay. Now, check each option. 1. Mistake means an error. 2. Wrong, incorrect. 3. Interest, liking or curiosity. 4. Quick means fast, without delay, same meaning as prompt. So, the correct answer is 4. Quick. Easy trick to remember. Prompt is equal to prompt reply is equal to quick reply. We say, please be prompt is equal to please be quick. One minute tip. If you see prompt in a sentence, try replacing it with quick if it fits, it's the right answer. Final answer, 4, quick. Frequently asked in SSC, Banking and other competitive English exams. Question 160. The synonym, same meaning of eschew is. First, understand. Eschew is a formal word which means to avoid something, especially for moral or practical reasons. Now, check the options. 1. Encounter means to face or come across something. 2. Meet to come face to face. 3. Avoid means to stay away from something, same as eschew. 4. Accept means to agree or receive. So, the correct answer is 3. Avoid. Easy trick to remember. Eschew sounds like sneeze. When you sneeze, people avoid you. So, eschew is equal to avoid. One minute tip. When you see eschew, always think, stay away from is equal to avoid. Final answer, 3. Avoid. Very useful word in SSC, UPSC, Banking and other English exams.